Hello, it's your girl Yasmin Lopez and today I'm back with another video. Okay, we are being projective and we're in the kitchen. I'm learning how to make. We're making enchiladas, homemade. Okay, say hi. Say hi to the Hello, hi there. She's my, my trainer today because I'm not the best cook, but she gonna get me to the, you know, the wifey level if I'm not, ready, I'm not already there. So yeah, just, you know, we're gonna try to walk y'all step by step and I'm kind of a beginner. She's like a pro. So if I can do it, y'all can do it, okay? If you have not already subscribed to my channel, make sure you are subscribed, you like, you comment down below, and let's make some enchiladas. So first thing we're gonna do is, um, we're taking the ground beef. Yeah, all right, I hear you, Delilah. First thing that we're gonna do is we're taking the ground beef, and what seasoning are we gonna use? We're gonna use some tuna saturated, and we're gonna use some roasted garlic. How much, are you ready to put it on? Yeah, go ahead. I put more on? I'll tell you when. I haven't put any on yet. Okay, so she's gonna tell me when to stop, okay? Mm. You don't touch it and mix it around? Um, you can. That's okay. Let's see. Oh, is that not enough? Oh, that's cool. Okay, that's Keep going. Uh -huh. All right, and so then when you mix it, you already mm -hmm. washed your hands? Yeah. Okay, so you can mix it in. Okay. Okay. Y'all don't go to my nails because I'm into my nails so long in a minute. You don't think it needs more? We can always add, we no. can add more. You gotta add a little bit more drip, you know? Here we go. Okay. There we go. And we put it in the pan? Uh-huh. Okay, just dump it in the pan? Yeah, you just put it in the pan, and then you can use your, um, the spoon to kind of break it up, like so. You know, just so that it'll brown, and it'll brown even. <laughs> Because you're gonna make enchiladas, you're gonna have like just pieces, pieces in it, of meat, like around right? it. I love the smell of ground beef. Mm. So, okay, I know you like the smell too. So I love. Like, chill out. <laughs> okay, so just kind of let that brown. Okay, don't need to mix it up more, and I'll just let it sit. Yeah, you can just let that brown up, mm. and then it's gonna kind of separate a little bit. Okay. And I'm already hungry. Mm. It's bad to I think cook while you're hungry because you just want to rush stuff, but I'm going to just wait so I can tear it up. Okay. I'm starving. So we're just going to let it brown. Let it brown. Okay, so while that's happening, you can actually um, start preparing your pan and start layering okay. your... Um, oh, we forgot to tell them all the ingredients that they need. So you need, for this, you need ground beef. Ground beef. You need corn tortillas. Mm -hmm. You need your seasoning to season your ground beef with. So we use the um, Creole seasoning and we also did the roasted garlic seasoning as well. And so you only recommend putting one pack of ground beef? So you should buy one pack? Well, it depends on how many people you're gonna feed. So if you're gonna make a small pan, you can do two packs okay. just so that it's nice and neat. If you're gonna do a small serving, then you can just have do one. Oh, one, pack, one Corn pack. tortillas, um, we're using what is brie fried beans. You finna have some gas. Okay. <laughs> and we're gonna um, use pico de gallo, okay? Mm. And we're supposed to have tomato. Are we are they bringing tomato? Yeah, okay. we have And you need some tomato sauce as well, okay? So you said we're gonna prep we're gonna prep our pan. Delilah, you wanna you can't you can't say hi because it's too low. Delilah, back up. Mm. Go back. Cooking with yeah, yes. partner. Let us know what other dishes you want to see us cook, and we're gonna um. Cool. I'm gonna try the ground beef browning, mixing it up. We still have a few like four minutes with this because we want it to be completely brown. We do not want it to be red because then we gonna die. We gonna die. We gonna die. Of this stack them or just lay them. Lay them. Um. If, yeah. There One, we go. Two. Three. Y'all really can't see. Hold on, let me show y'all. Okay, it looks like this. So you're just laying it like this, and I'll, I need one more. I usually don't like corn tortillas, but these smell good. It's that, it's that, it's that split, it's that split right there. Okay. Okay, so you got six. Yeah. Put it on each corner. Corner. There we go. Okay, perfect. So it looks like this. We said we're gonna lay the ground beef. Right. Yes. Mm -hmm. So you just spoon and then just 
Is it a certain amount of no, just spread it? Okay. Yeah, just so spread ground it. beef is done and she told me to just Oh wait, wait, wait. Not ground beef. I'm sorry, the refried beans first. Oh, it would have been messed up. These refried beans. Yes. Was that Rosarita Trodesina? Huh? Yeah. No, I don't want to open it. I don't think I know how to use a camera opener, but I'm gonna try. Girl. Yes, me. Oh. No. <laughs> open it up. <laughs> Why are y'all? I'm scared here. here. Oh, now. okay. There you go. And then you just turn it? Mm-hmm. Okay. You probably should just learn how to make a grilled cheese sandwich first. <laughs> I can cook. I don't need to use all these instruments. Instruments? Okay. I'm about to run out of here. Alright. So, did you open it? Oh, uh-uh. No, wait, 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 It didn't open. I don't judge me, huh? okay? Okay. So I'm dumping a little bit in each. Yeah, you're gonna spread it across. Okay. With a spoon or it don't matter? Um, use it. a spoon. Spoon. The Rosarita! <laughs> Does it matter how much? I'm, I'm gonna spread it in. You, know, you spread, spread it in evenly. Evenly. Yeah, we do not mess up my favorite meal. Jay, I'm not. It's gonna be tasty. Okay, so that's enough for that. That's enough. Spread it? Yes. Spread it, yeah, make sure it's on. Ugh. It's looking good, Jay. Stop. <laughs> I've been asking for this meal for months. <laughs> Give me a fork, Jay. What you need a fork for? Let's scoop some of it out. No, you don't need all that. This <laughs> hair is annoying. It's okay, I got it in my finger. Oh shit, I forgot I had booty. So whoever is farting tonight, do you have booty? Mm -mm. Okay, it's looking good though. Okay, here you go. So you're gonna spread it evenly, okay? Here, here. Oh no, you can't see. Use this, like making a PB and J. Oh, to make it more smooth, you know, like the split. It's the split right there. I just want to make it brush. You always get like one layer, but then you don't get two, two. We're taking the ground and I'm just gonna distribute it over yeah, it. Yeah. So my ground beef right here, I'm about to just jump for the layer. There we go. Drizzle it around. Hmm. More? Yeah. Okay. All right, that's that's enough. And then you'll put some on the top layer. Some more refried beans? Are you saying Okay, so now you gotta do your your tomatoes. Okay. Smell good too. I'm ready to eat right now. What you said, tomatoes next? Yeah. Think of the gallo or the tomatoes? Cause there's a difference. What? <laughs> well, we're gonna use pico. Okay. Yeah, cause it said it said diced tomatoes with green chilies. So what is that? You can use this. We're using alternatives. Okay, here you go. So here's the pico de gallo, and we're just gonna distribute it over. More? Look, when you do it, let me show you. So if you do it like that. I'm just saying more of a drizzle. Yeah, you can shake it over so it don't, you don't have so much in one location. Spot. Yeah. This looks, good. this looks good, Jay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Dinner ideas. Okay. You're making a banana pudding, Jay. 
Okay. okay. Now you can do another layer of corn. Of corn tortillas? Yes. Okay, so another layer of the corn tortillas. Six we did, so yep. we're gonna do six again. So we're gonna go one, two, three, four, five. You know what we forgot to do? What did we forget to cheese. do? Cheese. We need a layer of cheese. Oh, so we need to take the six off. Yeah. What's an enchilada without cheese, y'all? Lord help us. No more cheese. <sighs> uh, it's progress, okay? Making progress. Progress, progress. And we're just gonna drizzle the cheese over, right? It's, yeah. And so we're using shredded cheese. You're not using sliced cheese, I guess. How would I say This one is Kraft natural cheese, shredded cheddar cheese. So I'm just gonna drizzle it like she did the pico de gallo over it and i like a lot of cheese and i think they do too so we're gonna put a little a little nice amount is that enough yeah okay. it says we're gonna do another layer okay and then we're gonna go back to what we was about to do we're gonna take our corn tortillas and put the six back over make sure you cover the corners she told me so that's what i'm gonna do cover the corners mm -hmm. one two six then we're doing that whole stuff again yep okay mm -hmm. hey, so we started with the refried beans
Okay, so it looks like everything's done. So I'm gonna go ahead and get it out the oven. Ooh, they look real good, y'all. Is that a, a mm -hmm. uh, this? It's wet. Hmm. It's mm -hmm. over there is a mitt. Mm -hmm. Here, yeah. two hands shut. You don't want to think so. Cute. And then I'm gonna take this out. Be careful. Oh, it looks good. I'm about to drop it. <laughs> she almost dropped that on camera. I'm going to drop her ass on camera. Just leave it right there. Oh, no, it's still recording. Yes, yeah, so why you folded it up like that? She almost dropped it. I almost dropped it. Let me let my best life. Y'all want to see what my enchiladas look like? I ended up putting another layer over it. Just to, you know, make it more, you know, drippy. So I'm excited. I'm going to let y'all know how it tastes. Bam.